<laughs> driving and thriving. Yeah, anyway. Driving and thriving with Banjo. Uh, <clears throat> Don't y'all love it when karma turns around and actually bites the, uh, the, uh, the aggressor immediately? Let's see if y'all can relate. Y'all ever have that person that, uh, going slow, you're behind them. Uh, a couple miles ain't bad, you know, they're breaking and turning, you know. You see them, you see them eyeballing in the mirrors. You can see them. Maybe, maybe a mile of it I can handle. I can handle. Two miles, I'm starting to get, I'm starting to get a little bit antsy. Uh, three miles, <laughs> no, I'm past it. I'm over it by then. Well, every morning, Monday through Friday, we get up in the mornings, and we have this one person. <clears throat> well, I've ran into it several times, but we, we consistently get behind this one person. It's a white Hyundai Santa Fe. Every morning, we look up, and every morning, they get the old karma. The old belt whops them right across the rear end real good. But I tell you what happens. Well, Banjo's a thinker. He's watched the Truman Show. So he's uh, he's he's up to date on all the ins and outs on what people try to do when the cars want to hurry and get in front of you or just magically appear every death burn morning and 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 go slow. Don't get me wrong, I do not have road rage at all. And I don't fly all the time. But I've been fixing them. Every morning, I've been running behind this. Well, uh, what happened was, is I got behind this particular person that goes the same place where I'm going, the exact same place. We're always running behind, we're always running late because my kids, decide at the very end, while they're in the morning trying to get dressed, they can't find their shoes, or they want to change shoes at the last minute, or they didn't eat their gummies, or they didn't eat their breakfast, or they, there's always something to knock us behind. Well, so we're always running late, okay? Well, this particular time, y'all want you guys to try this, because I'm telling you, it works. I've done it a thousand times, and it works. Get behind the old good driver, the old white Hyundai Santa Fe. Well, anytime I turn my blinker on to the right, their blinker goes to the right. Well, I played a little game. Well, here we go again. Slowing down. Spitting. They tap their brakes and, they, and they're looking. So I know they're trying to be a rear end to Banjo. Why would anybody want to be a rear end to Banjo? Well, I tell the boys, sit back and shut up hold on tight well we come up to a uh, a a crossing okay and I can either go left and go to where we're going right to go to where we're going or straight across to go to where we're going there's three ways so there's it's it's there it's not coincidence that this happened I'm telling you it works people are rear ends out there on the road I promise you they are out to get you on the road the rear ends. They get up every morning. They drink their coffee and think, I wonder who I can make mad today. I'm telling you, they do. They do. I'm a firm believer of it. Well, this is what happens. We get up to this three-way. We could go. And she's she, she. I say she. It, it was a she. It is a she. Um, she's she's watching. She's watching the mirrors. And I'm just close enough to where I can see her eyeballs in the rearview mirror. And she's watching. Well, before I get up to the stop sign, I turn my blinker on a certain direction. And well, just so happens magically this day, she has to go this direction. <laughs> well, I keep my my blinker going in that direction. And, and this uh, car lady turns in that direction, which is left. <laughs> Banjo wasn't going left. He just played a Truman Show trick on you, lady. And you just fell for it. <laughs> Oh, oh, that made me, I was happy all day long because that happened to me. And uh, now every time, now every time I do it, 
she'll do the opposite. So I have to play double mind games in, in, with her. So when I turn my blinker on left, she goes right. She turns her blinker on right. I, either way, I'm a winner either way. If she goes to the right when I turn my blinker on left as a double mind game, I still win. She don't know how to take me. She don't know what to do. So now she, she, don't, she don't even look for my blinker. She just goes the direction she's supposed to go, and I go right the totally opposite direction. But it's so funny to watch her in the mirror looking at me and wondering which way I'm going to go because she's dying to get in front of me and keep tapping her dead burn brakes on a 30 mile an hour road and she won't go but 15. But now she's, the old banjo got the best of her and now she she's, she don't do that no more. Karma done bit her in the hind end and uh, Banjo outsmarts her every time because now she don't know which way Banjo's gonna go. Because there's three different ways that you can get to this particular spot where we're going early in the mornings. <sighs> and that made my day. Y'all let me know if y'all run in. Y'all try it, y'all try it. I'm telling you it works. When you run into the, that person, turn your blinker on, think of ahead of time where you're gonna go and how many time, how many places you can get there in, in the, either direction and make that person do what you turn the blinker on they'll, they'll turn their blinker on the same direction because i'm telling you they get out they are on purpose doing it and i'm telling you i'm not it's not a coincidence it's not a conspiracy try it and see if it works for you guys let me know in the comments below if you ever ran into that person thank you have a good day